And good morning, Ross. Us. This is Mr. Lawson here in the front office, welcoming you to Tuesday, the fifth day of school. Since we were out yesterday because of the storm damage and the follow-up from Hurricane Hillary, I hope all of you are well, that your families were safe, and that everything was okay where you live. Uh, you'll notice in the front of the school, all of those great big Palo Verde trees are gone because they all fell out into the street from the storm but we got those taken care of quickly and the campus, I wanna say thank you to our custodians and our groundskeepers who came in yesterday and worked all day long, really worked hard to make sure everything was ready for you to come back to be safe here at school. There will be a few changes because of the weather delays. You might notice that some of the choices at lunch this week are gonna be different uh, because some of the ingredients and some of the things that we get in our district for, from supply. Um, some of those were disrupted because of the storm, so we'll have a few different choices this week. Speaking of this week, though, first of all, a reminder, if you haven't already, I think everyone has for 10, 11, and 12, but we still have about 100 freshmen that need to join the Google Classroom for the class of 27, so make sure you join that so that you get all the latest information, the flyers, the notices, photos, everything about running school we've put in there to keep you informed. And whenever we get close to a dance or a special event, all the information from our ASB students is there as well. So it's important that you sign up for those Google Classrooms. I would like to say this morning, a hearty Raja welcome to Mr. Kenley. He is helping to fill in as one of our administrators. During the summer, Mr. Gutierrez made a job change. And so now we are advertising and soon we'll be interviewing a new assistant principal that will be working out of the discipline, safety and Dean's office. Filling in for now, we are happy to welcome Mr. Kinley. You'll see him around campus. Mr. Kinley was principal of Chaparral High School in Temecula and of Desert Hot Springs High School. He has a lot of experience and great friends and I'm happy to have him join us as we open the school year until we have that position permanently filled. So as you see him today, say welcome, Mr. Kinley. We're happy to have him be part of our Raja family. I have a couple of quick reminders. Remember in the morning, the first bell to notify you that school's about to start will ring at 8.20 and then at 8.30 or 8.29, the music starts, which gives you a one minute warning to get in class. And at 8.30, you should already be there, ready to start the day and the music stops, the bell rings, that means class has begun. Some of you that come through the gate at 8.30, now you're late. And just so you all are hearing this as another reminder, after 8.30, no Starbucks, no Dutch Brothers, anything like that doesn't come in the gate. Those privileges and you need to be here on time and in your seat in order to bring those in with you. So make sure you're here. And we want you to be in class on time every period. So when that music starts, I need to see everyone every period hustling and getting to class. That music tells you you got on a one minute only left to get there. When you come through the gate, make sure you have your lanyard on. You'll notice a change on the back. On the back this year, we have the uh, suicide hotline, the safe house um, hotline, and the national domestic violence hotline, and uh, a fentanyl, uh, dangers of fentanyl QR code. We have information there on the back so that you can get help when you need it very quickly. So please make sure that you check those out. But your lanyard needs to be on each and every day. Have it on as you come through the gate. If you don't have one, we'll send you to activities. You'll need to buy a replacement. I provide the first one free, but after that, you'll need to buy one. After a couple of times of not having one, you get to have a parent conference with me and mom or dad or guardian as to why we're not with our lanyard. Also, make sure we're dressing for success. Remember, we dress appropriately for every occasion in our life. If we're going to church, a wedding, a quinceanera, a funeral, a special occasion, we dress appropriately. We don't go to those events like we're going to the beach or to a swim party at somebody's house that has a swimming pool. We dress for the occasion. And just like that, we dress appropriately for school. I'm asking every classroom, please remind everyone of pages 32, 33 in our handbook. Go over the dress code for me one more time and our expectations. Also, speaking of lunch a moment ago when I told you some of the choices have changed. When you come out of the cafeteria, you will see a long table that is a shared table. I'm going to put some bins, but please don't just throw things on the table. Please help arrange them and organize them. Put your stuff down that you don't want with other things that are just like that, like all the apples together, all the milk together, because there are several students who would appreciate being able to still have something to eat. Sometimes if you're hungry, you might want a little extra something. 
What you don't want, if you leave it on the table, don't throw it in the trash. We have people here at school, some of your fellow students that would greatly appreciate that. So help me to help you and let's take care of that share table and make it nice and easy to find and easy to sort. And speaking of after lunch, not throwing away the food that you want, I do want you to throw away your trash. You'll see two pictures here. One of them is the lunch table. You know, you've done such a great job. Last year, everybody was really great to throw away their own trash. And if you saw somebody leave trash, you reminded them or you threw it away. You see me out there every day with those tongs picking up trash because I want you to have a nice, clean place to go to school. We wouldn't leave stuff like that on our kitchen tables for our parents to clean up. I expect you to do the same here. So please throw that away. And in our classroom, it's not the custodian's job to clean up after us. Their job is to vacuum the rooms, some light dusting to take care of the trash cans, but not to go around and pick up stuff that each of us leave behind. We shouldn't be leaving things behind. Tilted a desk and this is what fell out. That should never happen. Please throw your trash in the trash can. Do not leave it on the, in the desk or on the floor. That makes it a lot harder for the custodians to get around to every room. They have a schedule and limited number of rooms, and it's not their job when it's ours. You need to throw away the stuff that you don't use. And one event coming up this week. Congratulations, seniors, on your senior year. We're excited. We had a special day for you making crowns the day before school started so you could be Raja royalty on our first day. Well, now we have Senior Sunrise this coming Friday. We'll be meeting out at the stadium. You'll hear more. Check out Instagram and the Google Classroom in the next couple of days as ASB Senior Class puts a lot more information in there. But mark it on your calendar for this Friday morning before school. We will have Senior Sunrise. And make sure you bring a pen because we are going to give you a note, uh, a note card where you can write a note to yourself. We'll tell you more about it on Friday morning. And then we'll give it back to you at Senior Sunset. A great way to give yourself some encouragement to talk about what you want to do, what your dream is for this year, what you hope for, and then you get to read it back to yourself on Senior Sunset. Pretty cool uh, last year when seniors got to read what they wrote to themselves to push them across the finish line. So with that, I hope you have a great day today. Thank you for helping us spread Raja Pride with positivity, respect, integrity, determination, and excellence. Have a great day, Rajas.